This time we are going to talk about how to get the information you need for a currency pair. This little expert advisor can tell you almost everything you need to know about this currency pair and you see that the values are changing with every tick and if you know how to do that you can get almost every information you need for your own trading. Now how can we create an expert advisor that is able to give us all these values here? To do that please click on the little button here or press your F4 key and now you should see the meta editor and in the meta editor you want to click on file new expert advisor from template continue I will call this one simple currency info continue continue and finish and now you want to remove everything above the on tick function and the two command lines here we are talking about this because from time to time people ask me something like this this person wanted to know how to get the spread for a currency pair and so i created this code and now we are going to do the advanced version of it the first thing is how to get the spread for the current currency pair. And we use symbol info integer for the current symbol. And with symbol underline spread, we can calculate the spread. And the value will go into the spread variable here. So that was symbol info integer. And if you have seen a few other videos in this series, you might have seen this one. To get the ask price, we use symbol info double for the current symbol and we use symbol underline ask. And the reason is symbol info double will give you a double value for a floating variable and symbol info integer can only deliver an integer. So the spread in our case does not have a decimal point. And to get the bit price you need to change the name of the variable and you need to use symbol underline bit instead. You might have noticed that your broker charges you swap fees. And if you want to know how much the swap costs you, you can use symbol info double for the current symbol and with symbol underline swap long you can calculate the swap for the long trades and like in the example above symbol info double for the current symbol with symbol swap short will give you the swap value for the short trades if you want to know the last lowest point you can use symbol info double for the current symbol and with symbol underline last low you will get the last lowest point on your chart. Let's get the last high by using symbol info double for the current symbol and here we use symbol underline last high. If you want to find out what the lowest possible lot size for this currency pair is we use symbol info double for the current symbol and with symbol underline volume underline min you will get the minimal volume you have to trade. If you go below this value you would see an error in your journal tab. And as you might have guessed you can also calculate the max volume that is done by using symbol info double for the current symbol and here we use symbol underline volume underline max. Some brokers do not support micro lots. And if your broker does, you will see that on your chart if you use symbol info double for the current symbol and symbol underline volume underline step will give you the minimal volume change step for deal execution. As you can see, you can get lots of valuable information about the current symbol on your chart and it's always the same way to get it. 
if you use the right function here, for example, symbol info double, and if you use the right expression here, for example, symbol volume step, you can calculate almost every value you can think of. And now in the last step, we are actually going to create the output on our chart by using the command function. Now let's compile the code here by pressing F7 or clicking on the little button. And we have no errors here. So now you can click on the little button over here or press F4 to go back to MetaTrader. And in MetaTrader, you want to click on View, Strategy Tester or press Ctrl and R. And here in the Strategy Tester, please choose Simple Currency Info.ex5, enable the visualization mode here and start your test. And here we see everything on our chart. The current spread is 15. And if we speed up our trading a little bit here, you will see the spread change. And that's the same for the last high or the last low. And now you know how to create an expert advisor that will tell you everything about the current currency pair on your chart. And you have coded it yourself with a few lines of MQL5 code.